layouts are easy in Vegas. Hit Control Alt D on your computer keyboard, followed by a number from the top row of keys as opposed to the numeric keypad. For example, to save the current layout, hit Control Alt D and then the number one. Recall the layout by hitting Alt D and then the number. In this case, Alt D one. Drag your windows wherever you like them, make them whatever size you like them. Control Alt D and a number and you're all set. Let's go back to where we were before. Alt D zero takes us back here. If you have a two monitor set up, you might want to put your video scopes and your surround panner and maybe even a vent pan crop on your second monitor. In any event, you can drag these windows anywhere you like. Control Alt D plus a number saves the layout. Recall the layout with Alt D and the number. This is the Vegas toolbar. If you'd like to customize the toolbar, go to Options, Customize Toolbar. Let's take a look at this. On the left, we have all the available commands that can be added to the toolbar. We click on one, we can add it by clicking the Add button. To remove one from the current toolbar buttons list on the right, click Remove. You'll note that in addition to the usual suspects, open, save, properties, you can add a separator to separate the categories, as you see here. I've added three buttons of my own, new audio track, new video track, and open in SoundForge. Like the way my Vegas looks, you can thank the folks at Vast, V-A-S-S-T dot com. I downloaded Windows themes from them, customize them to my own liking, and here they are. All you have to do is make sure you've enabled Windows XP theme support in your options preferences. Right-click on your desktop, click Properties, go to the Themes tab, and pick a theme. Then go to Appearance, Advanced, and take a look at what you can do. You can change the color of individual elements of the interface. Very powerful. Just make sure you save your new layout. Let's take a look at Options Preferences. Click the Preview Device tab. If you have a Blackmagic Deck Link, or a DV camcorder, or a second external monitor hooked up, you'll be able to access them here. Click the Print Device tab, and you can select your deck link or your DV camcorder as print output devices. Click the External Control tab. If you have an external device, you can control it here. Later on, we're going to install a Shuttle Pro. Click the Keyboard tab. You can create custom keyboard mappings for Vegas. In fact, if you use an application such as Sonar, you can import custom keyboard mappings from another application. Click the Editing tab. For those of you used to dedicated editing controllers, the JKL keys work here too, and you can adjust the speed of the scrub right here. Layouts, Toolbar, Preferences in Vegas.